Hello y'all, this is going to be a special video about Hard Spiron 4 and the mods for it that are really hard to find. Basically on Hoi 4 Steam Workshop, if you go to Browse and then hit Items and then go down and click on the box next to Show Incompatible Items, you will be able to find mods that can still be played but for one reason or another, Paradox or Steam or whoever runs the workshop has delisted them. And what this means is you can't find these mods if you use the search bar on the workshop. What we're going to do is take a look at a few delisted mods and guess why they were made incompatible. Alright, mod number one. It is Speed Plus. It increases game speed and I have no idea why this mod would be incompatible. Maybe it has to do with the thumbnail. Mod number two, Stand with Ukraine. This mod is relatively new. It came out on March 1st, 2022, and I think it has to do with the Russian invasion of Ukraine. I'm not sure. The description is all in acrylic. I want to assume it's Ukrainian. It could be Russian. I don't know. But I guess the fact this mod is political and has to do with recent events is why it is delisted. Mod number three, New World RP or New World Roleplay. It does have a lot of stuff in it. It seems like something that would be good maybe if you played Hoi 4 multiplayer, but I don't know why it's delisted. Maybe it has to do with the fact the German Reich has their historical flag, which has the no-no sign, as I will just call it for the sake of this video. Mod number four, the sexy portrait mod. I'm not going to show the contents of this one, but I'm going to let you guess why this one was made into an incompatible item. Mod number five, the I Saw Productions mod. This mod is all about the YouTuber I Saw Productions who makes a lot of Holy Four content. Oh, look, the USSR is called the Rice Fields. And, hmm, if I had to give a reason for why this was delisted, I would say maybe edginess? I don't know, edgy content in it, perhaps? Mod number six, the historical German flag. It replaces the German Reich's flag with the historical version, which I say will do enough in explaining why this mod has been made incompatible. Mod number seven, send people to Brazil. This mod, I assume, is inspired by the meme you're going to Brazil and what it does is add in a new occupation law. If I had to assume why, well if I had to guess why this mod was made incompatible, I would say maybe the powers that be thought it could be seen as offensive. Mod number eight, get rickrolled every time you start Hoi 4. And going by the name, I will presume that this mod makes it so Rick Astley's Never Gonna Give You Up song will play whenever you start the game. Why was this made the way it is? Well, made delisted in the first place? I don't know. You know the rules, and so do I. Mod number nine. What if Hitler was Hitler? Judging by the file size of this mod, I don't think it does anything. It was just sort of made as a joke. Maybe the people that run the workshop thought this mod should be made incompatible because it's nothing really there in the first place. Well, in its file size anyway, just a page, honestly. Mod number 10, Donald Trump commenting on things, parentheses, voiceover. What this mod does is it makes it so whenever you select a unit, its line will be said by something Donald Trump has said. Its line has been replaced by whatever Donald Trump has said. Whatever is in this mod. If I had to give a reason why this mod was made incompatible and delisted, I would say it's because of its political nature. Mod number 11, 3DM Chinese localization. This mod localizes the game into Chinese. I think that's what it does. Anyway, as for why it's made incompatible, why it is incompatible, I'm not going to say I don't know. Uh, okay, I don't know. I, I'm, I have no words. Mod number 12, what if my school superintendent was the Fuhrer of the Third Reich? Oh no. Well, if I had to guess why, well, what it does, it replaces Hitler with whoever this, the mod author's school superintendent, it replaces Hitler with them. 
if I had to guess why this mod is incompatible, I would say maybe the school superintendent reported it if they found out about it. Mod number 13, Donald Trump, US fascist leader. It does what it says it does. It makes Donald Trump into the fascist leader of the United States. It also seems to make Bernie Sanders the communist leader of the United States. As for why this mod was made incompatible, maybe it was seen as too political. Here we are at mod number 14, and it is serious strong. Also, what is going on here? Look at this. Look at all the chaos in this. Just what happened to it? They had Peter Griffin with the face of Ben Shapiro. Then I, I don't know. I can't really describe it. This is absurd. I just can't describe it. But if I had to guess why this mod was made listed, maybe like the Donald Trump U.S. fascist leader one. The powers that be, the people who run the workshop, thought it was too political. Mod number 15, No Italy. What it does, it makes all of Italy just disappear. Why is this mod delisted? No clue. Maybe an Italian thought it was offensive and reported it because their entire country no longer exists on the map. Mod number 16, Fascist Latvia Potato Flag. It's exactly what it sounds like. It makes the flag of Fascist Latvia have a big old potato in the middle. Why is this delisted? Perhaps someone thought it was too stereotypical. Mod number 17, Alex's Napoleonic Wars mod. This mod just appears to be about the Napoleonic Wars period. In the early 1800s, it doesn't seem to break any rules, so I wonder to myself, why is it delisted? Is there a deeper story here I'm missing? Mod number 18, Modern Generals. This mod is a sub-mod for Millennium Dawn, the modern day mod. And what it does, it adds commanders to countries around the world. Why is it delisted or made incompatible? I'll let you figure that one out cause I have no clue. Mod number 19, World War Bruh. This is a multiplayer overhaul mod made for the Bulkin 1 community. Bulkin 1, if I'm saying his name right, he is a Danish YouTuber who makes Hoi4 videos. Well, he mainly does Hoi4 videos, I think he does FIFA stuff and things like that. But anyway, why is this delisted? I can't tell you. I, I really can't. Mod number 20, this is the last one we're going to look at. This is Kaiser Redux, a Kaiserreich expansion. Kaiser Redux is the largest of the incompatible mods with a whopping 140,000 subscribers. So it's nothing small at all. And why is this mod made incompatible or delisted from the workshop? I have no clue. It's like World War Bra. I can't really tell you. It's strange, honestly. That is all the Forbidden Hoi 4 mods I'm going to check out for this video. I'm going to leave you with a question. What determines what mods on the Hoi 4 Steam Workshop get hidden away or not? With that said, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day. I'll see y'all later. Bye.